Vikings. Introducing the challengers. At a combined weight of 700 pounds, Fox and the Viking, Chaos. Viking. And introducing the champions. At a combined weight of 360 pounds, they are the WCW World Tag Team Champions, Nicholas and the Lawman, Judy the Hooligan. Get ready for some WWE magic. Everyone's ready, and just like that, this tag team match is underway. All the budding tag teams out there hoping to one day make it to the big stage better be watching this match with a notepad in hand because you can bet this is going to be a lesson in how it's done. Paying attention to the back now. What an amazing display of athleticism. Perfectly executed. Concerned look on the face of the champ. He's going to have to cut off his opponent's offense quickly. It's no secret that quick tags lead to success in the tag team division. And I'd say the quicker he can make that tag here, the better their chances of winning. Nice. If things don't change in a hurry, this has all the makings of a short evening for him. There have been times in sports entertainment when unlikely duos have formed and over time they develop and bond and become an outstanding tag team combination. The team that immediately comes to mind is the powerhouse duo of Cesaro and Sheamus. After their thrilling best of seven series, I wouldn't think they'd develop into a top tag team. The champ's starting to falter a bit, and you have to wonder wow. how much more the champ has to give. If I'm his partner, I'm furious right now. There's no reason why he shouldn't have made a tag by now. But I don't think anyone thought Cesaro and Sheamus would develop into a premier tag team. Over time, the superstars realized that they were better as allies than as enemies. And when they combined their incredible strength, the results were something that couldn't be ignored. It was really unbelievable to witness the evolution of Cesaro and Sheamus as a team. We saw them improve every week and conquer a variety of opponents. To see the Swiss Cyborg and Celtic Warrior go from unwilling partners to WWE Raw Tag Team Champions was truly impressive. Oh, I think, can he end it quickly? This might be it. That's how you move up the ladder here at WWE. Incredible. He's fighting from underneath. Look at that a second time. That's a great example of teamwork right there. Can he finish the job? Look at to catch him off guard. He's making a statement here with this attack. He's sending a message to the entire WWE Jeez. locker room here. Getting his attention with a vicious strike. Well done. He's fighting from underneath. In off the tag. He isn't showing much life. Such a dangerous hold. I don't think he's got it. Whoa, he works his way out. A bit of a Houdini job right there. The champ's starting to stumble oh, a bit. But he's the champ for a reason. Ooh. It would take a whole heck of a lot more to stop him here tonight. It looks to me like his partner's itching to get in there. 
and now might be a good time to give him what he wants. Oh, wow. he's certainly in a tough spot here, guys, but there's still plenty of time. Plus, it's not like his opponent is running away with this thing. Well, at least not yet, anyway. Starting to struggle. We know what this is. It's a stampede. One of the most heated robberies we've seen on Monday Night Raw has been the tag team division. Enzo and Big Cass have clashed with Cesaro and Sheamus on several occasions. The realest guys in the rooms have come within fractions of a second of defeating the Swiss Cyborg and Celtic Warrior. This night on Raw, they were determined to finish the job and become number one contenders to the Raw Tag Team titles. The champ is just being outclassed right now. On the April 4th, 2017 episode of Raw, Enzo and Big Cass had the opportunity to become number one contenders to the Raw Tag Team Championship. They had to get through rival Cesaro and Sheamus first. Enzo and Cass started off strong with their signature high-energy offense and quick tags, but the combined strength of Cesaro and Sheamus gave them control of the match. Yeah, it was only a matter of time before the moron of all morons, Enzo and Cass, could no longer endure the power of the Swiss Cyborg and Celtic Warrior. Sheamus press slammed it. Well, it doesn't look like the champ's afraid of anything, does it? How could he not be? He's inflicting some serious pain here. He is a one-man gang in there. One move after the other. It's devastating. He isn't showing much life here, guys. Hold on, guys. This isn't good. No question about it, Cole. Look at this! Man, this is gonna hurt. Up on the shoulders here. And there's no easy landing spot when it comes to a fireman's carry. He's fighting from underneath. And now one more time. He may be in the best physical condition I've ever seen him in. The champ is in a bad way here. Here we go a second time. He's delivering an old-fashioned butt kicking right here. The champ looking absolutely defeated right now. I think it's safe to say that this might be the beginning of the end for the champ. You know what? It's just not his night, fellas. I mean, he's already executed his finisher twice, and neither time did it lead to victory. That just tells me he just doesn't have it to me. Guys, you can tell he's drained, but I guarantee you that won't stop him from doing everything he can to win this thing. Tagged in. Teamwork at its best. Really struggling now. He's fighting from underneath. Phenomenal forearm! That should do it. Yeah, that truly was a thing of beauty. His shoulders are down. I don't like to throw away. Wait a minute. Here are your winners. And still, WCW World Tag Team Champions, Nicholas and the Terror. The What's he doing? Hooligans. Quite some back and forth there before finally picking up the win. If these guys choose to stay together, they have all the makings of being one of the best duos WWE has ever seen.
Thank you for tuning in tonight, folks. We hope you enjoyed that great match.